Psalm 6 gives voice to someone who is very ill, confined to their bed, and even near to death. At its midpoint come these words, In death no man remembereth thee, and who will give thee thanks in the pit? It's a desperate plea for God's help, and is strikingly graphic in its description of the sheer discomfort of a serious sickness. But the final two verses have a dramatically different feel to them, beginning with these words, The Lord hath heard my petition. Perhaps there has been an improvement in the sick person's condition, or maybe it's the actual act of wrestling in prayer with God that has changed the way things seem to be. O Lord, rebuke me not in thine indignation, neither chasten me in thy displeasure. Have mercy upon me, O Lord, for I am weak. O Lord, heal me, for my bones are vexed. My soul also is sore troubled. But, Lord, how long wilt thou punish me? Turn me, O Lord, and deliver my soul. O save me for thy mercy's sake. For in death no man remembereth thee, and who will give thee thanks in the pit? I am weary of my groaning, Every night wash I my bed, and water my couch with my tears. My beauty is gone for very trouble, and worn away because of all mine enemies. Away from me, all ye that work vanity, for the Lord hath heard the voice of my weeping. The Lord hath heard my petition, the Lord will receive my prayer. All mine enemies shall be confounded and so vexed, they shall be turned back and put to shame suddenly.